Good morning, this is Brian Johnson, and I have a confession for you to make as I sit here in my kitchen uh, about to make a smoothie. I'm going to share with you what I'm doing specifically and why. And here is my confession to you. So from Friday to yesterday, I had a total of five pizzas. They might be saying, wow, that's a lot. Yeah, it's a whole lot. I may have like one a week. And uh, I just felt that my body required some rest, and I really just took a break and unplugged and had pizzas and enjoyed myself and had sweets and all kinds of stuff and I totally felt like a dog turd because of how just nasty my nervous system felt how just bleh. I don't see how people can do that on a consistent basis and every once in a while it's okay to do a little reset so here's what I'm doing to reset all the stuff that I did now one of the most important things you'll find is going to be this you've heard me talk about good belly big shots this is what they look like they're in a little bitty shot container just like this now this probiotic is amazing because this actually makes it through your gut lining so the hydrochloric acids and the gastric juices in our intestinal tract does not mess with it which is amazing which means it gets down into our intestines and it actually creates and proliferates and grows and creates good bacteria to balance out all the nastiness and it does make a difference on your digestion so I added about 12 ounces of Kangen water from my machine over there also got some of this at Costco. It's a mixture of greens and different things in there. I probably put about four ounces in there. Now, here's what I'm doing next. I'm gonna give you a little view here. So, I've got my water, A, blender, bam. I've got my wheatgrass here. So what I'm gonna do is just trim it off the top. I like wheatgrass. This is your number one blood pressure lowerer. It's extremely alkaline, which is also another great uh, tool to boost oxygen, boost alkalinity, reverse pain, and all that. Now, this is a pretty big chunk of turmeric. It's a blood purifier. Great for your liver, your kidneys, great for glutathione production to get all the trash out of my system. And here's a little chunk of ginger. Not a lot, it doesn't take a lot of these, okay? That's those two, and it does stain your fingers. So, watch it. All right, so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add, probably looks like, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven asparagus to boost my detoxification. And the beauty of the fruits that I'm going to use, which is going to be strawberries and blueberries, is that these are all organic. These are from Costco. Frozen. I like frozen. I have some fresh ones too. I like frozen ones because I don't have to add any ice, which is great. So a full cup goes in. Put those up in a minute. Then I've got blueberries. I like using berries because they're low glycemic, which means they turn the sugar the slowest. Strawberries are very amazing because they're great for prostate cancer and breast cancer situations. Blueberries are amazing for our eyes because of the lutein. Great, very bright orange color, which is an anthocyanin, which is great for causing apoptosis in cancer cells or suicide in cancer cells. You may have saw the video that I did on acai a couple days ago. Apoptosis means that cancer cells kill themselves um, through cell suicide, which is great. Okay. Now, I'm going to add some of this protein after I blend this up. Okay, and I'll use mine, which is 40 grams. All right. So all I'm going to do is blend this. When this is done blending, I'm going to add my protein in there to balance it out. And that's what I got. Okay. And that's one of the smoothies that I use to help myself to detoxify after I've had a festivity of nice foods and things like that. And here's the deal. Um, you're going to have things like that. So understanding how to implement these types of things into your lifestyle will help the backlash to be 50% less, which is a huge deal. Like I can tell you that in my old days when I used to eat a pizza, a deep dish pizza or something like that, literally if I ate it on Friday, it would take me until Wednesday before my body balanced back out from all so the water. It would literally take me a week to balance back out from all the toxicities and things like that. Now, if this is you and you're looking to create a, an amazing rocking body of health, as my friend Marcy Locke was saying, you're not understanding how to do it, I invite you to join me and potentially be a part of my next six-week challenge. It starts in two weeks. Uh, I posted a link yesterday to the video that I posted yesterday, and if you are interested in learning more about it and seeing if you are a good fit for what I do, 
I'm going to be covering a lot of stuff on nutrition, goal setting, mindset stuff. I'm basically going to be teaching you the same things that I teach my high-level performers in a very short, condensed amount of time in a small group setting for a fraction amount of the investment. So if you are interested in learning more and you are committed to your outcome, make sure that you fill out the application and I'll leave it in my post so you have it. Uh, if not, um, then I encourage you just to use some of this information and make it work for you. And if you're looking to get information specifically for you, then your option is to definitely trust me, follow my advice, and take the next step and fill out my application to see if or how I can support you. So have an amazing day. And remember, if you don't make time for your wellness, you will make time for your illness. Bye-bye.